Hey, what's up everybody? Shinwo here with Geeking Out. And you know what today is? It's new comic book day. Yes, new comic book day. And I got a bunch of books to show you. So let's just jump right into it. So enough of all that. Y'all know why I'm here. I'm here to talk about comics, comics. All right, guys, starting off for a new comic book day from a couple weeks ago. Uh, this was from Jack in the Box. Uh, this was free <laughs> return of Mark Hamill. Um, issue number one, it's one shot. Uh, this was free. I just will say, even though it was free, uh, I think they should have did a better job um, with the shipping and handling, with the packaging. Uh, it was obviously media mail and uh, a couple uh, dents. Uh, wasn't too happy about it, but hey, it's free, right? So what can you say? So let's see, from Scout Comics, we have uh, Aza the Barbed, number one. Strange number six. From Image, uh, we have Donny Cates and Ryan Stegman back together for Vanish, issue number one. Carnage number six. Uh, Black Adam number four of 12. Got White Adam on the cover. Iron Cat number four. Radiant Black number 18. Uh, Deceased issue number two with the Jim Lee uh, X-Men homage variant. Pretty cool. Shirtless Bear Fighter number two. Love this series, man. And you got a uh, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Biagi, a play on Mr. Miyagi from uh, the Karate Kid. Uh, Judgment Day, uh, Avengers X Men Eternals issue number five. And from Boom Studios, we have Stuff of Nightmares. This is cover B. Pretty cool. Uh, so let's see, from last week, we have Street Fighter uh, Masters Chun-Li, issue number one from Udon Comics. Big Street Fighter fan, especially with Street Fighter 6 on the rise. Uh, main cover. And then got the one in five variant. I really like this cover with uh, Cammy there with uh, Chun's alternate color outfit. Pretty dope. It's really nice. Uh, flawed number one. Thunderbolts number two. Young Justice Targets issue number three. Miles Morales Spider-Man number 42. This is the end of this run. They went 42 issues. Uh, kind of ended lackluster. I'm still not a big fan of this outfit, but um, they're rebooting it and he's going back to his, uh, his classic outfit. So yeah. Briar number one from Boom Studios. Task Force Z, issue number 12. And actually, this was the last run of this as well. All done. Uh, Shang-Chi and the Ten Rings, issue number three. This is a cool cover here. One of my favorites, uh, Eight Billion Genies. Uh, this is issue number five. And what's funny is both uh, Charles uh, Soleil and Ryan Brown will be at New York Comic Con this weekend. So I'm thinking about taking uh, issue number one, go get it signed and graded. So yeah, might as well. Thor number 27. Uh, Justice League versus the Legion of Superheroes number six, cover B. Um, you got Green Lantern and her name oh my gosh what is her name she had her cw show i can't think of her name oh my gosh anyway yeah it'll come back to me and last but not least we have mighty morphin power rangers issue number 100 uh cool issue cool issue and uh this ends or taps the end of this story and we move on to um mighty morphin power rangers 101 this is main cover and then got the foil variant of a uh, Red Ranger holding a helmet. Pretty cool. 
And I got this bad boy in the mail uh, last weekend. Well, this past weekend. Isom number one from Ripperverse Comics. Shout out Eric July. Uh, I'm not getting into the politics of all that, whether you agree or disagree. It was a good issue. Solid, solid introduction uh, to Isom and, and, and Yara. Yara? 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 I think it's Yara. Um, and just every in this world that we're getting into really takes me back to just street level stuff. Um, obviously, a lot of them got, you know, super abilities, but no gimmicks. Um, so I'm looking forward to, to, to growing with this uh, this universe here. So oh, shout out to Eric July, Young Ripper. So uh, that's all I got, guys. Thank you for viewing. Thank you guys for tuning in. Um, New York Comic Con is this weekend, so I'm looking forward to that. I'll definitely have a video up um, of some of the you know merch and exclusives that I can get my hands on. Uh, got my tickets for Black Adam, tickets for Black Panther. Uh, was it War for Wakanda? Wakanda Forever. I'm thinking of uh, the Avengers game. Uh, Wakanda Forever. So uh, that's in November. So. Yeah, so we're moving along, guys. So thank you for tuning in. I will catch you guys next time. Peace.